What's up everybody? It's Neil here with Gadget Hacks. Today I'll be showing you how to apply widgets on the home screen of your iOS 8 device as well as highlighting a very cool transparent weather widget just to get you started. So widgets on iOS 8 are available in the notification center if you have any actually added. Um, and they're really convenient. You can access them from any screen because you can access your notification center from any screen. But some widgets are useful on the home screen, like a music widget, a weather widget, obviously, or a clock widget. So today, let's go over and show you how to do that. You will need to be jailbroken, so definitely check out the iOS 8 jailbreak guide on gadgethacks.com. After doing that, just head into the Cydia store, which is much like an app store for jailbreak tweaks. So I'm just going to go ahead and hit the search option and put iWidgets. So you go, so I'm gonna hit the first one that comes up. Now I already have it installed, so you would go ahead and tap tap install right there on the top right corner, and your device will reboot. Now let's go ahead and show you how to actually apply the widget. So you just go on any blank area or empty area on your home screen, tap and hold, and the widgets menu will come up. So I do have a third option, but by default it only comes with analog and calendar. I'll go over the third one in a second. So analog clock, let's just show you how to apply these. There you go. So it's pretty ugly as you can see and I just uh, tap and hold to move it around. Now let's go ahead and show you the calendar which is also pretty ugly so I definitely suggest checking the city store for other themes or widgets you can use. So there you go, those come by default and I didn't want to show you those so I'm going to go ahead and show you how to get a pretty cool looking weather widget that also displays time as well. So you're going back into Cydia, hit search, now just put stripe and it'll be this one. So it looks like that with that purple icon. You just go ahead and install that. And once it's actually installed and all ready to go, you just tap and hold and it'll be added to the widgets page as you saw earlier. So now I have stripe. So I'm just going to go ahead and now with stripe you actually have some options. Now you can enter a WOEID. You can do this easily. I'd link out to a Yahoo page which lets you type in your city and it gives you the ID and that way you get actual weather information relevant to your city or area. Then there's a design. It says no conditions right now but I want a big icon on top. Then you have background. I'm going to leave it transparent but you have your choice of a few colors. Uh, text color as well. You can change that. I'm going to leave it white. Uh, weather icon. Let's do a white icon. Uh, units of measurement, GPS, you can enable all that if you want. Let's just go ahead and add it now. So there it is. I'm going to go ahead and place it on my home screen. And then there you, there you go. So it looks pretty cool. I definitely dig the style. I like the icons. I like its transparency. I get the weather information. I get the time and date. And it's uh, fairly useful. And uh, as you can see, it looks pretty cool on my home screen. So unfortunately, when you're formatting it, it can be placed over icons, or sorry, app icons, which is kind of a bummer. So I just leave a space down there on the bottom of my screen. And it doesn't look too bad there. Definitely check out the full guide on GadgetHacks.com, especially if you want to check out that jailbreak guide. Also, don't forget to like, comment, and definitely subscribe for some more awesome and real useful Gadget Hack videos. Alright, thanks for watching, guys.